This is Wade News at Noon. An LMPD officer is in the hospital right now after somebody shot him early this morning. And right now he's in critical condition. He's stable, but he's critical. You're watching Wave News at Noon. I'm Kathleen Ninke. And I'm Josh Ninke. It all started with a traffic stop in the Chickasaw neighborhood. That was around 2 o'clock this morning on West Kentucky Street there at 40th and 39th. Sean Bowdy joining us live from there now with a breakdown, Sean, of what happened. Yeah, guys, we're about a block away now because uh, we know police officers are still over there. Uh, Olivia Russell uh, with with us here at Wave uh, has been there for hours as well. We're going on 10 hours, still a heavy police presence uh, over there as well. You mentioned the, the officer state, but as always, situations like this, LMPD uh, keeping a lot of that information close to the chest. We do know about that officer, uh, that he's been on the job for about a year and a half, started with that traffic stop. Uh, so about a block away where we're standing, for example, we are uh, behind the camera is the uh, Foster Traditional Academy over here on 41st Street. Uh, this is an area just a block away where a lot of people are walking their kids to school. This is an area where a lot of people are walking to work uh, as well. So we caught up with some of those people and, and, and just asked them about what they saw this morning and, and how concerning it is to see something that's happened so close to home. A lot of the parents tell us they're concerned for their kids' safety every time they walk out the door, not just walking to school, but just playing outside. And one parent told us she felt guilty just letting her kids walk outside sometimes because this isn't the first time uh, that they've seen something like this. A lot of the roads here uh, have been uh, blocked off, block by block. Uh, some of those have opened back up, but with that police presence still where that standoff was uh, over on 40th, you still might have some trouble getting through there. So just pay attention uh, online here at Wave News. We're going to update you uh, with any of that information as soon as we get it. Olivia Russell said she saw three different people walked away in handcuffs. Again, we don't know uh, if any of those three related to the shooting, if all of them were related to the shooting, but we'll make sure to let you know as soon as we can. Reporting live in Louisville, Sean Bowdy, Wave News. Absolutely, Wave News has been bringing you minute-to-minute -minute updates for the now almost 12 hours that that situation's been going on. Thanks, Sean.